this regularly scheduled meeting of the Harlington City Commission, which has been duly posted to order. And at this time, call upon uh, Commissioner Victor Leal to lead us in an invitation. Join me in prayer. Heavenly Father, we just come before you this day and ask for your mercy and just allow us to be able to do things that honor and glorify your name. Lord, just allow us to conduct the business of this city. And Lord, just a blessing over each and every one of our employees and just a hedge of protection of, uh, around our police and fire department. We do all these things you know, to honor and glorify you. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. Amen. Please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome everyone. We're glad to have you here at our city commission meeting tonight. The first item on the agenda is the proclamation proclaiming the week of July 10th through July 14th, 2017 as Recreation Therapy Week. Is there anyone here to receive that proclamation for Recreation Therapy Week? We had, we had made some phone calls, so uh, since they're not here, we'll go ahead and pass, pass that and we'll present this at a later time. Uh, when there's someone here to receive the proclamation. So item two is the community-wide trash off day held on June 10th, 2010. Good evening, Mr. Mayor, Commissioner, Mr. Sedna. Just a, a quick recap on how our month of June went. We had a community trash off that day. Uh, it was uh, June 10th at the Harnjan Soccer Complex. We were there from eight to 12 and as usual, our volunteers, we were people lined up, ready to go. So 8 o'clock in the morning, we were ready to go. As you can see, they were loaded up. That day, we were able to collect 7.57 uh, tons of debris in a four-hour period. So we did really well that day. A few pictures of how our volunteers went. Mr. DeLue is always there, as, as always. Our volunteers, which is at the my house this time, helped us out. They stepped it up a little bit. It was hot, but we still got it done. Uh, we were able to collect 122 tires in a four-hour period as well. So we did, we feel we did a pretty good impact in our, within our city. So we're part of that. So we have our next uh, cleanup would be this weekend. And this type of event is what keeps our city clean and beautiful. So we'll be doing a, uh, a neighborhood cleanup. It'll be from 77 Sunshine Strip to 21st from <coughs> East Mountain to East Madison District. You will be there from 8 to 12 again. So. We have to invite anybody who is willing to participate to come out and help us out and keep this neighborhood clean as well. Uh, we had some, not certificates, we actually were going to give a plaque this time for Mr. DeLue and his family, but they weren't done in time, so the next one was when we'll present them to Mr. DeLue and his family, so we're part of them as well. Okay, well, great. That was uh, a great effort, and congratulations to everybody, and thank you to everybody who was involved in, in making that happen there. These events are really important for our community. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. I have three is the approval of the minutes of the joint meeting of the Harlan City Commission and the Development Corporation of Harlan on May 30th, 2017, and the regular meeting of June 7th, 2017. Are there any additions or corrections to the minutes? Hearing none, are there motions to approve both sets of minutes? So moved. Second. All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed, like sign, motion carries. <coughs> Consent agenda items 4A through D. Is there a motion to adopt the consent agenda? So moved, Mayor. Second. All those in favor say aye. Aye. Supposed by sign. Motion carries. Item 5 is consideration of possible action to approve a request from Rodagua Guadalupe Garza, Jr., for a certificate of public necessity and convenience to operate a taxi cab business under the proposed name of Taxi Express in the city of Arlington. Good evening. Yes, sir. Uh, my name is Rene Garza. I'm just here to request a uh, permit to operate a taxi cab uh, within the city of Harlingen. And I believe I met all the requirements that the ordinance requires. And uh, if y'all have any questions, I'm open to that as well. Okay, thank you. We're going to let the uh, police department present the application. Thanks. Good evening, Mayor and City Commissioners. <clears throat> Mr. Rene Guadalupe de la Garza is requesting for a new company to be approved under the name of Taxi Express. Um, he from, formerly worked for Planum Transportation. He will have a location of 513 East Jackson and will be driving a 2013 Nissan Altima. Um, the driver and the owner, who's the same, the location and the vehicle have passed all inspections and requirements as per city ordinance. We have no objections. 
Are there any questions? Yes. <clears throat> Staff recommendation is to approve the request. That is correct. Sir. <coughs> I motion to approve the request for the certificate. So moved. Second. Any discussion? All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Like sign. Motion carries. Thank you, sir. Right. Thank you. Good luck, Mr. Garza. Thank you. Item six: Consideration of possible action to approve a resolution suspending the effective date of the. Uh, July 20th, 2017, the Texas Gas Service Statement of Intent to increase rates within the incorporated areas of its service territory to permit the city's uh, time to study the request and establish reasonable rates, finding that the city's reasonable rate case expenses shall be reimbursed by the company authorizing participation with the other Red Grand Valley municipalities, hiring legal counsel and consulting services to negotiate with the company and direct any necessary litigation appeals, finding the meeting at which this resolution is passed is open to the public as required by law. Okay. Mayor, members of the commission, city manager, um, on June 15, Texas Gas Service filed a statement of intent seeking to increase our gas utility rates. They're asking for an 18.35% increase or equivalent of $4.5 million in revenue. Um, Texas Gas Service has received a cost of service adjustment for the past eight years, although cities were not able to um, uh, actually inter intervene in that case because in any of the cases because there weren't statement of intents because this is one and it was requested by cities last year uh, cities have to either suspend deny or approve the filing um, if a city takes no action then it's uh, approved administratively uh, on june 26 the uh, uh, development council held a, a conference call with valley cities uh, about this particular issue uh, kevin pagan from the city attorney for the city of McAllen agreed to act as a chairperson for this uh, consortium. Uh, they've hired the law firm of Jeffrey Gay from uh, Lloyd Gonsalink out of uh, Austin uh, to intervene in this case. Um, any expenses incurred by the coalition will be paid for by uh, Texas Gas Service. So we are recommending approval of the resolution. I'd be happy to answer any questions if you have. Yeah, so this uh, 18 point whatever percent increase, this is not just for Harlingen but for all the entire valley where they have all the valley cities yes sir that's correct <clears throat> and these are only paid for by people that actually have gas service in their homes or their businesses okay <clears throat> all we're doing is delaying the date right yes we're suspending the uh the effective date of july 20th to give us time to actually review their filing and make any necessary adjustments is there a motion to approve the resolution so moved second any discussion? All those in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed, like sign, motion carries. Item seven of board appointments. Any board appointments? None. Any board? Okay, no board appointments. Item eight is an executive session pursuant to section 551.071, Texas Government Code, attorney consultation to provide legal advice regarding legal impact of cell tower litigation. Is there a motion to go into executive session? Someone. Second. Second. All those in favor say aye. Aye. Those opposed, like sign, motion carries. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the uh, city commission is going to go into executive session to meet with their attorney, and we'll be in the back. There are no uh, there are no other items on the agenda for action or discussion other than other than public comment. So we're going to retire to meet with our attorney at this time. Uh, okay, we're out of executive session at 6 p.m. Last item on the agenda is citizen communication. Yeah. Yeah, Yolanda Trafford in reference to taxis. Okay. Yolanda Trafford. You know, competition is Andrea, very please. good. 580 Altas Palmas, what do you want? She moved. I haven't moved. Not that I know unless you live with me. Listen. Competition is great. It's always been great. I always say that the more people that do something, you know, the more people that you get uh, better service. That's why I like competition. Okay, now we have a taxi service. As you all know, you got the platinum over there at the airport, which is a monopoly. And the reason it's a monopoly is because uh, the taxi service is not allowed to pick up anybody when the airline gets there. 
and the taxi service that you have in the city, which you just gave permission for another one to be part of the city, uh, to pick up people, is just to go and leave them at the airport. They're not allowed to pick up. That's where the money is. When you pick up somebody at the airport and they want to go to Rio Grande City, they want to go to Bronzeville, they want to go anywhere. That's where the mula is. That's where the money is. So, in other words, the airport has a monopoly and it's against the law to have a monopoly. <coughs> So I think a lawsuit is very, very, and you can win it. You can win this monopoly because it's easy to win. Thank you very much. All right. That's, the only one. That's all. Yes. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, our meeting is adjourned. Thank you. Thank you.